born as an ordinary person. At vertex it is reborn as a wealthy and powerful person. For 正门玄观世正门 他正好位于当中不偏向作业不偏向有不在上也不在下当灵性投入身体后此门关闭了假如我们不欲明师指的灵性将无正门可出离身体他只能由其他旁门出去眼耳口 比度其顶门，如果灵性走旁门，亦有耳而出者，来生当为胎生之动物，如麻猪、牛、羊之类；二有眼而出者，来生当为卵生之动物，如飞鸟之类；三有口而出者。来生当为师生之动物，如鱼、虾之类；四有底而出者，来生当为化生之动物，如苍蝇、蜜蜂之类；五有肚脐而出者，来生当为平庸之人；六有顶门而出者，来生当为富贵之人。上述之路乃生死轮回之路，不能脱出生死之苦。点传师点开玄关正门，这是通天之路，我们不必再走四门，不必再坠入轮回受苦。但是我们必须要真修，否则玄关虽开。我们的灵性仍不能反天，因我们还是充满罪恶。灵性为罪恶所是不能自由从正门而出的。五点。In the Bible, Matthew 14:11, John said to his disciples, "I baptize you with water to show that you have repented." But that one who will come after me will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. The Tao is transmitted to you in the temple of God through God as sanction and commandment. The holy lamp on the altar symbolizes God. In the transmittal ritual, the teacher uses the incense to a lead a line of fire from the holy lamp to your heavenly portal. Then, using his finger, he connects God as spirit with your spirit so that they flow together as one, thereby enlightening you with God as spirit. This is the actual fulfillment of John as prophecy. Five. 圣经上记载约翰被他的门徒说我用水给你们施洗表明你们已悔改然而在我之后的将用圣灵与火给你们施洗请记忆你们是在上帝的宫殿里得到因为我们有上帝的天命那盏佛灯代表上帝老在点道之仪式中你们已见到点传师已相助从佛灯引来一条经旨向你们的玄关然后借点传师的手指点在你们的玄关之时上帝以一的圣灵已点开了你们的心窍照破了黑暗现在你们可见到约翰之欲